Today's design and construction process is wasteful. By its iterative nature, it's typically inefficient and requires significant amounts of rework. On top of that, it's often difficult to exchange models between parties, especially considering that different teams have different software preferences. But more than that, the industry could benefit from having better communication tactics. Data can and already is solving this problem by augmenting storytelling capabilities. We are surrounded by data, but many professionals are uncertain how to access it and make use of it in meaningful ways. This could stem from a lack of transparency and reluctant attitude toward collaboration in the industry. The entire topic of data can be a black box for architects and designers. Business intelligence tools like MS Power BI are powerful and have a low barrier to entry. Users can get started without ever needing to write a single line of code. Simple drag and drop interfaces and ready-made templates can help novice users go from something that looks like a spreadsheet to an interactive dashboard with very little training and minimal investment. We can prepare to use data by taking steps to streamline the design process. The problem of data interoperability has been a focus of conversation for several years and is well understood by architects. Solutions are widely available and can help design teams to clarify data and make it easier to access. This example shows data being pushed from Rhino to Revit, reducing the overall effort needed and establishing a relationship between the two data sets. As I mentioned, data can be a key component to our design stories. We just aren't taking advantage of it. Architects are in a great position to think about data as a storytelling device. We've been trained throughout our education and careers to deeply understand storytelling and its power. It's arguably our most important skill. We use tools like concept diagrams and renderings to help others vividly imagine the places that we're working to create. Data is just as convincing, if not more, especially when key metrics are used to drive decision making. Here's an example of a report that I recently built looking at an arena design and its relationship to user experience and revenue. The dashboard lets users adjust key performance criteria and gives measurable outcomes. As a former stadium designer, this is something that I wish I would have known how to do to help me communicate to my clients. Views, proximity to the field of action, distance to amenities, and more can be tied to revenue data and other performance indicators. Models like this can demonstrate to clients that you're truly considering the aspects they care most about and using that information to make better design decisions. We see this as a way to augment storytelling and improve outcomes for all parties. Here's another example that could be used to communicate between a team of structural engineers and contractors. We're linking data from a structural model to a construction timeline, combining different types of data sources to tell a more complete story. We're able to overlay even more information and draw connections across larger volumes of data. With a centralized data server and harvester, we can extract data from a number of models. Minimal input is required to build a robust data repository. The data can then be used to compare models and discover trends and other key insights across a large portfolio of projects. In this example, we're seeing a compilation of data from a variety of different models. In it, we can synthesize and discover key trends in programming, quantities, and other meaningful measures. Teams can use similar setups to compare data from an entire market of projects. They can use the results for activities like diagnosing model health or setting expectations for new projects. We can even look at this application and its use for existing buildings. This digital twin example shows a combination of building, climate, staff, and asset data. We can track things like when furniture or hardware needs to be replaced, who is comfortable with the temperature in a space, and many other data points in one central location. Dashboards like this could become deliverables and valuable services that clients can use throughout occupancy. There are so many potentials and we've barely scratched the surface here. Thank you for your time. You can visit apps.provingground.io to learn more.